last week on the coaching call, we had a golfer who said, I'm, I'm better in practice on the practice range than I am on the course. And I said, okay, so what happens between when you go, and he was convinced it was a physical issue. He says, my swing breaks down as soon as I get on the course. Right. Why would a swing break down when you walk over from practice over to real competition? Why? I, and I was a little facetious and I said, well, did you drink a lot of alcohol between the practice round and uh, the practice area and the competition area? No. So did you get injured going from here to there? No. Nothing physical happened to create interference that made the competition swing not work. Same thing with this pool player. So I can't stress this enough. You've got to go to where the real problem is. Now, normal sports psych techniques are, are, are things like turn your thoughts positive, which is why he says the thoughts don't choke aren't the problem for me. So if some mental guru says, well, you just need to start thinking positive, it's not going to do a darn thing for him because he's not triggering it with thoughts of don't choke, don't choke, don't choke. What's really happening? We have belief programs here at the unconscious level. The red ones are useless ones or useless in terms of what's relative to our goals. In this case, relative to doing well in pool playing, pool competition, billiards. Green ones are useful beliefs. Black ones, uh, represented in my model, are just neutral. They have no bearing on what we're trying to do. So, for example, a neutral belief program would be, oh, something, let's just say, you know, I believe uh, your political beliefs, right? That has nothing to do with playing pool. So, therefore, it doesn't get triggered. Now, what do I mean by get triggered, right? The unconscious mind controls the body. You're fine when you're at home, practicing pool on the practice range. None of those red ones are triggered. Now, in the pool player's case, it's high competition, high pressure. This is, and what that means, it's a red dot or a useless belief program relative to doing good at pool that says, this is extremely important. And what happens is the unconscious mind, anytime something is extremely important like that to you, it's going to trigger a response in your body. And it's basically the fear response, which means get ready to tackle this head on with all your focus and energy. And well, basically that's it. It's to put you right there. Well, that is not an optimal state for sports where fine motor skills like golf and pool and tennis and gymnastics and lots of sports like that. And so it is interference because blood, <clears throat> um, all your nervous system responses are all geared up for heavy do the action, mostly the big muscles. You don't need big muscles in playing pool. So that takes away fine motor skills in the tips of your fingers. Basketball shot, if you're in that state, triggered by one of these belief programs.